Hi everyone, guess what? Today I'm in Lisbon and I will take you with me around this beautiful city before starting a very long journey. Are you ready? What you waiting for? Let's go! First things first, we have to have a breakfast with such a wonderful vision. Can you just see the pastéis de nata? Are basically custard inside a rounded puff pastry. This is how actually the buses look like. And this one... It's mine, which is going from Lisbon to Milan, but I will just tap over in Madrid. Let's go, guys. Flixbus. Yep, that's right. You heard it well. These giant green buses will just take me from Portugal to Spain, exactly from Lisbon to Madrid. And I'm super excited to take you with me. No time to waste. Let's go. Hi, everyone. Here I am again. Just to tell you that here it is, the test that is starting right here, right now. Basically, I will be testing my iPhone 15 Pro Max the whole journey, all the day long, literally. We just started and yeah, we are in Lisbon Oriente station and now we are ready to just go off to Spain. I'm super excited, super speechless as well, but hey, here I am with 100% battery charged and now we will just put the iPhone under stress because yeah, I will be just editing some videos, listening to some music and then later on I will be just, <laughs> as you know, sinking inside some social media platforms. But I will be testing and stressing my phone the whole day even because this journey will take me eight hours and a half off to Madrid, Spain, the capital of Spain. So I will be actually, you know, going from one capital to another capital of two different countries will be challenging. As you can see also, the weather is not that good right in the morning, but hopefully it will switch to, ah, a beautiful sunny day. Yeah, guys, I will just leave you for a while to just enjoy these wonderful panoramic views and these wholesome cathedrals. Yeah, both of the countries are Christian and uh, yeah, are surrounded as well by beautiful castles as well. Wow. Yeah, this is me pretending to be real, but no, I'm faking sleeping. It's not true, guys. Don't fall for it. We are off to the first Spanish city, which is Badajoz. And basically from Lisbon to Badajoz are 225 kilometers, which are around a couple of hours. And yeah, it's pretty fast. I super love all the security measures that Flixbus is adopting because those electronic mirrors are super, super safe. Hey, the Spanish bull just say welcome, bienvenidos a España. And we are in Merida bus station with still 83%. We just arrived in Spain. Actually, we arrived already since when we entered to Badajoz. So here it is, guys. And we are exactly at the Avenida de la Libertad, the Freedom Avenue. And here it is the situation. Actually, I'm not editing right now. I didn't start yet because I'm lazy and. Maybe later, but yeah, still 83% until now. I'm just listening a bunch of music. Madrid, I still cannot see you, but I can feel you. This trip is taking forever. In case you are wondering why I'm not flying to Madrid, but I'm taking the bus instead, the answer is pretty easy. I found her at the ticket at the 8 euro and 99 cents. So guys, it seems like we arrived. This is the battery. It's 66%. It's incredible. And I've been listening music and uh, watched TikTok. I did many things and stuff. I didn't edit. I call it my 
grandparents, you know, two, three times watching TikTok a lot of time. Guys, it seems like we finally made it. I am in Madrid. This bus will just continue until Milan, Italy. But I'm stopping up over here. So let's go out. That's great. OMG. It took forever. Eight hours and the health but we can say nine hours because yeah from starting from 9 30 until now that it's 7 14 so imagine where is the exit over here finalmente madrid no lo puedo creer tío pepe bienvenido welcome guys here it is madrid La Puerta del Sol. That's great. Now I've been vlogging, and of course, I have only 43% of the battery. But so far, so good because what time is it? 21:38. So it's 9:40 p.m. So still, we have pretty much half of the battery guys as you can see I'm still outside even though it's 11 p.m. and uh, yeah I was jumping at the McDonald's because I was starving and still the iPhone it's at the 22% it's uh, yeah on the way to just abandon me but still with 22% I do believe that we can still just um, pull it up till midnight I think all right and I can tell you that the iPhone 15 Pro Max it's still at the 12% of battery so absolutely he successfully succeeded because guess what today is already another day it's midnight and 45 so it's almost 1 a.m and it's 16 november so yeah a full day is gone and still has 12 percent guys 12 great <laughs> 